Hello, my name is Susie Arundel. This is my leadership book review for the N5343 Leadership of Complex Healthcare Systems course. The title of this book is The Truth About Leadership, The No Fads, Heart of the Matter, Facts You Need to Know, and it's by James Cousas and Barry Posner. The qualifications for these authors are James Cousas is the Dean's Executive Pro Professor of Leadership at Levy School of Business at Santa Clara University, and he is one of the leading executive educators in the United States on the subject of leadership. Barry Z. Posner is the Professor of Leadership at Santa Clara University, and he has served as Dean of the Levy School of Business from 1996 to 2009. There's additional qualifications for these authors. Um, these gentlemen have co-authored um, several books, and one major book that's been uh, around for many years, The Leadership Challenge, has been around for about 30 years. They also co-authored A Leader's Legacy, Credibility, Encouraging the Heart, The Leadership Challenge Workbook, and over a dozen other books and workbooks in leadership. They also developed The Leadership Practices Inventory, which is an assessment tool for leadership. The purpose of this book is to provide time-tested practical truths for leaders. It also takes a fresh look at fundamental behaviors and actions and practices of leaders that have essentially remained the same over the years. It also helps leaders think, decide, and act more effectively. The target audience for this uh, book are emerging leaders. Uh, such as the students in this class, those who are new to the role of, trans, uh, the role of leadership or those transi transitioning to leadership roles for the first time. It's also a good book for experienced leaders, those who are continuing to hone their skills, and it's a good book for coaches, those who want to be more capable of coaching other people to be more effective leaders. Some of the strengths of this book are that it's easy to read, each truth is a standalone chapter. Uh, it entails real life uh, leadership examples uh, in this book. It encourages emerging leaders. It stirs a fresh passion in experienced leaders, and it's evidence based. Some of the shortcomings of this uh, book, according to um, McCrimmon in 2004, he wrote that the Kuzis and Posner. Uh, values style of leadership excludes thought leadership. Thought leadership refers to any instance of influencing others to accept a different or new way of looking at things. Personal credibility is the foundation of leadership according to Kuzis and Posner, but with thought leadership, credibility is attached to the idea of innovation and not really to the person. Are the objectives in this book achieved? I would say most definitely. Um, the ideas were practical, the information was relevant 30 years ago, and it is still relevant today. It's a useful resource uh, to become a more effective leader, and it's a great asset to have in our leadership toolbox. I do recommend this book. It's practical and usable, especially for the emerging and or transitioning leader it challenges you to believe in yourself and your leadership abilities. It's very positive and it's uplifting. One of the quotes from this book were, sometime, somewhere, the leader within you may get a call to step forward. Some supporting opinions for this book come from Jack Covert, and he uh, directly markets business books to businesses all over the world, and he says the 10 truths that are compiled uh, from thousands and thousands of stories from leaders all over the world are a good resource. And uh, this information has been collected for several decades. It's um, practical and usable, um, Jack Covert says. I believe that's all I have to say. Um, if you have any questions, uh, I'd be happy to take any right now. Thank you.